be transparent elections. Right now, the second international symposium on intellectual property protection and enforcement is ongoing with the theme highlighting the challenge of counterfeits in the healthcare system. Now, the World Economic Forum has reported an annual global economy loss of $2.2 trillion due to illicit trade, which is approximately 3% of the GDP. Now, with these statistics, the Anti-Counterfeit Authority is calling for collaborative efforts to combat trade in counterfeit pharmaceutical products, medical products, food and beverages, and also pollutants across the globe. A cabinet secretary put in place a task force that was looking at the entire business environment. The task force is uh, progressing on well. I think they are yet to give their final report. It will look at all the issues that uh, actually the manufacturers bring forward to, to government that affect the cost of production. What we are doing now, we are also reaching out to the traders. We are reaching out to the business people and businesses across the country and having a conversation and engagement uh, so that we tell them the, the effect of uh, even importing counterfeiting goods and also dealing in the counterfeit goods because ideally they have impact on health and safety of the consumers. So we're partnering uh, the Anti-Counterfeit Authority for this, uh, for this second symposium. Uh, we were also attending this our IP Taché last year and we find that this is a very important event uh, to sensitize but also to uh, allow the policy makers and enforcers uh, to interact and to find solution to this big issue of, uh, of counterfeiting. Right now, in order to provide solutions,